What is up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. We are once again in the garage because we have another upgrade that I just upgraded. Let me explain. I recently put this windshield on, but this is the one I ordered for the wrong year. Uh, this is for a 2014 and up because the bolt patterns don't line up. And if you remember from that video, I had to drill holes into this windshield to make it work. So we're going to fix that today. Let me pop open the box and we'll show you what we got. All right. As you can see, we have a, we just got us a clockworks windshield for this thing. Did some work the other day on my buddy's truck. And this was payment for services rendered. And all right, in the box here, we got a few instructions. Yes, they do offer some uh, chrome accent trim, but we already got some, so don't need that. Also in the box, they give you some swag. You got some clockwork sticker and a get clocked sticker. Heck yeah, we'll put them on our toolbox at work probably. I'll open up the foam here. Probably not the best way to open this with a razor knife, but that's what I got. All right, as you can see, we didn't get the super dark. We got just a light tinted uh, clockworks. See all this uh, protective plastic on I'm gonna leave that on there until I get it on the bike. You can see all your alignment holes here, and there, and there. Yeah. Before we actually put it on the bike, we're gonna go take the bike out and give you a little comparison. I got 360 on there. And I'll have my GoPro on the helmet so we can kind of give you a wind comparison. So we'll do that first and then we'll come back and put this one on. So we'll cut to the bike now. Alright guys, welcome back. Alright, so now we're going to take this old one off. Super simple. You've seen me do it in the other video, but I'll show you again this one. Three bolts, trim piece, pop the, new, pop the old one out, pop the new one in, trim piece, put the bolts back in, and we're gravy. Let me do that real quick. Yep. I'm taller than a foot. 
There's four feet. All right, we got the old one out. I'll just recycle that one. And now we got our clockworks. We're gonna pull the film back just a little bit, just enough to get it in there. And then we'll uh, pull it all the way off when we get it in the, all the way on the bike. Come on, stupid film. There we go. Just like that. Be careful. I'll take this one and. That fits. That fits so much better than that other one did. Remember, always start those screws by hand. Don't start any of those with a drill. You'll Peel the film off. All right, let me show you what we got here. This is the the new windshield. That is a light tint, uh, Clockworks, and they have a they had a clear, and then they had a dark smoke, which is black. But I like to see through it sometimes, and I'm not a fan of just a black solid windshield. So we went with that, the light tint. The only issue I'm seeing is that right there. You see the top part of that. Uh, hole right there. I don't know if that's supposed to be like that or because it's all the way down on both sides. On that side and on this side. But it's uh, sticking up right there. And I don't know why. So, but anyway. A nice little clean clockworks emblem there. See it from the, from the back. It's good for my height. If you're shorter you can get a a shorter one, so on the side looks pretty good. It's got that nice little flare that kicks the wind up. The other one didn't have that flare, so we're gonna set up the I gotta set up 360 again, but on a different mount because it was coming loose on this cheap thing it came with. So uh, yeah, we're gonna do that, and we'll take you on the bike again. Give me just a minute, get that set back up, and then we'll take you back around around the block like we did a minute ago and test out the footage or test out the wind noise Be right. good morning everybody I guess this is going to be a test of our new windshield because uh, I filmed the before yesterday and the after and I didn't have the microphone set up correctly so I had no audio when I put the new microphone in this helmet God, there's an adapter you have to put in there too and I had to take it out of my old helmet and put it in this one so you should be having audio now um, I might not have a before test of the windshield I might just play the other one and just kind of voice over it or something but this one is the new one the wind goes up and over so much better and these little areas on the side pushes the wind out around your head so there's no buffeting. Uh, it should sound pretty good in this helmet. Uh, we're uh, road testing it today. We're uh, me and the buddy Jim back there from the club. We're, we're headed to Paris Mountain, South Carolina, and Sassafras Mountain with uh, some of the club, but not exactly sure exactly how many. But, uh, yeah. So yeah, this is just a little test, a little review of that thing. I love it so far. Other than that little hole right there, I don't think I have it down right or something, but I'll figure that out down the road. Uh, I gotta ask my buddy Dave about that one. Uh, 
gotta stop and get some fuel. And we'll be on the road, so. Back to the garage. Alright guys, welcome back. We're done. We got this windshield so much better than that other one. Um, hope you guys enjoyed the 360 footage. Uh, something a little different when trying to change up on these videos. If you have any questions or comments about the windshield or anything, uh, just leave them down below in the comments. Uh, the Clockworks windshield that I use will be linked in the description below. So yeah, that's pretty much all there is to this little video. Uh, just changing out, upgrading the windshield. To make it more comfortable and a lot less wind noise so y'all stay tuned here soon we should have uh, a video coming out of our new exhaust or changing out of these god awful loud things to something a little more quieter with still a little bass so yeah stay tuned for that uh if y'all guys are new here get under hit that subscribe button turn the bell on so you get notified when we post new videos i appreciate you watching we'll see you in the next one